Hey, welcome back, everybody. Sign here again with another well, new series. Uh, this is Skybees, and let me go ahead and do the things, and we'll just do that. There we go. Much better. Well, actually, Skybees 2. I may remember I actually played Skybees 1. There's our bedrock, okay. Um, it was a while ago now, but... Uh, there we go. And hey, cool, we have Utila Mine. Nice. Oh, that one grew too. Nice. All right. Uh, let's see. Well, let's look at our quest book, right? Let me go ahead. Do that, and then... There we go. 32 logs for the first quest. Okay, we can we can do this. But, uh, Skyblock, all of our resource generation is going to be, you know, debased, as, you know, the name kind of hints at. And... Yeah, it's been a while, but I uh, did play the first one. Yeah, it's been a while now, but I did rather enjoy that pack, actually. So, figured go ahead and uh, give the sequel a try. Alright, so... Get ourselves a little bit of a platform going here. We have like a crook at all that I can get extra saplings with. Nope. Okay. And do some twerking. Uh, we have the tutorial going in the top right corner of the screen. That's something I usually enjoy actually. But you know, it's something that's on by default, so. There we go. And... Come on. <laughs> the Cydia Collector Crystal. I wonder if that's messing with things here. Shouldn't be. Oh, hi. Uh, yeah, the one that, okay, grew was the one that's furthest away from that crystal, okay. It might be kind of in the way, actually. Oh well. Shouldn't take us too long to get half a stack of logs. Oh, I love when that happens. You just get shoved into the ground by a tree growing. So much fun. Alright, and... I need seven more, so probably just... Well, two more trees. Yeah, this one's only six. See ya. Thank God for Utila Mine, though. Although in a Skyblock, it is very easy to make a, uh, a very tragic mistake with Utila Mine. But the good news is the default only allows for up to uh, 64 blocks. So usually it's not too bad of a thing unless you accidentally, you know, mine out your entire AE system. All right. 64 planks, okay. We get what, four per? Okay, cool. And Tinker's Patterns, we need a composter as well. Okay, so let's get started on crafting things, I guess. There's that. And then I need a recipes of slabs to get a composter going for bone meal. I'm guessing is the reason for doing this. And hey, look at that. I was right. Bone meal. Oh, the compost structure didn't show up in JEI. Okay. All right, so we have patterns. And then it's like, hey, make a wooden comma. Makes sense. So. Uh, 
Well, that's a crafting station, which would be probably a good idea, actually. Uh, tinker station? Sure, why not? And then, okay, crafting station there. Uh, part builder. There we go. Very good. So we're going to go part builder, tinker station, and crafting station like that, right? In you go. Boom. To make a comma, I need a small blade, a handle, and a binding. Okay. So, small blade, binding, handle. Like so. And now we need leaves. Okay. Here we go, and... 58 leaves, good to go. Grab ourselves some more logs and string. Three leaves equal one string. All right, cool. That's not bad. Use a string to make water strainers, beds, and soul snares for blood magic and beehive. Six planks, three string for a beehive. All right, there's that, that, and you. There we go. Uh, for now, you can live there. Now, here's a question. Yep. There's our first bone meal, which unlocks, well, bone block, which I'm guessing looks like it leads into clay. Seeds, which leads into animal crops, okay. And then floral fertilizer from Batania. Uh, soul snare, what do you need? Iron and redstone. Okay, so that's a little ways away yet. And I'm guessing this is locked behind here. Yeah, here probably. We need a water bucket. Okay. So let's go ahead and... Uh, let's go ahead and repair our comma, because apparently that almost broke it. Oh, it's only got 60 durability, so yeah. Hey, I just busted it. Okay. All right. Uh, I've got a bit of grass here, so I can do that. that. We got peanut seeds from Thermal, and we got wheat seeds. Seed ore and breaking grass, seed ore, but I still got it from grass, so. And I need six more string to make a bed. Let's get one of those made up because while well, phantoms are a thing and yeah. I hate phantoms with a passion, so. And then strainer, strainer base requires a brick hopper and bricks or metal hopper and iron bars. Okay. Brick hopper is just five bricks. We need block of brick. Okay. That's probably not the way to get it. Okay. We can uncraft clay blocks, which. Ah, bone block into clay. Probably why we had this thing up here. All right, then. Now here's a question. Nope. Okay, we don't have. We have Batania. We don't have the Garden of Glass though, so we can't uh, get pebbles. That's a question then. Cobblestone. Like a regular just cobblestone generator. Oh, the custom machinery mod. Okay. That is literally it. Just the crusher. Okay. Uh. Let's look up the crusher then. How do you made? Smooth stone, stone, and a cast iron gear from FTB jar. Okay. The FTB jar mod, we use that in ocean block, and that is 
No, I like that mod. Clever, it's new. Makes sense. Hey, the sun's going down already. So I need clay for here, which is kind of odd that this leads to clay. I need a bone block though. So I'm going to need a lot of leaves in here to make bone meal. Good God. There we go. Um, I guess I could do that for now. And we'll grow the peanuts too, I guess. I used up so many of my leaves to do that. Oh, it works on that too. Cool. Okay. Well, I just broke my, uh, my comma again. Not you, uh, you. That plus that equals that. All right. So. Oh, that's cool. It resets to 70%. Okay, that was interesting. At least behind me there. Well, we're getting tons of peanuts anyway. Which, our food. Oh, we have a uh, Vice Life Carrot as well. Oh, that is so much better for getting bone meal than leaves are. Wish I can just hold right click and just Mass shift next to this thing. And it looks like I'm getting, what, two per? All right, awesome. And then we have some wheat. We're getting extra seeds as well. Uh, we can do ocelot seeds, uh, pig with carrots, okay. Carrot seeds with dye. Mossy rock, okay. Mushroom seeds is wheat and, okay. Wheat and mush red mushrooms, it looks like. Squid seeds is any fish, okay. Horse seeds are golden apples. Fox is raw rabbit and sweet berries. Llama is sugar and wheat. Turtle is seagrass and pickle. Chicken seeds is simply five. Okay. Dolphin seed. Uh, we got the chicken feed. Donkey. Cow seed is eight wheat. Okay. Sheep seeds are wheat and, and seeds. All right, cool. All right, so I'll see everybody in just a few minutes then. All right, so it's morning. Uh, we've got ourselves our nine bone meal. Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, the crafting tweaks doesn't apply to crafting stations quite yet. Um, right. Let's try this one. Nope, you're not automatically linked. That's a shame. All right, so... <laughs> The uh, the linking tool is going to be the thing we need, right? Custom recipe. Blue dye. Blue okay, blue dye I can get from RGB honeycombs. Corn flour. Okay. All right, or lapis. All right, lapis we get out of probably lapis bees. Villager trading's a thing. But yeah. So corn flour. Uh, that's a ways away there. Let's get some tools made up, actually. Uh, we'll get a couple of these then, and one of you, and one of you for now. I want to pick because I have to pick up this uh, thing I just made. There we go. All right, so 
Bone block is a quest done. Clay. Range of the collector crystal. Right click the collector crystal with the linking tool. Okay. Floral fertilizer to get blue dye. Okay. Floral fertilizer is bone meal plus any four dyes. So in other words, I'm going to need more dirt here soon. Uh, which is water straining. Or, you know, tempered glass and a soldier jar, but I don't really have the ability to make glass yet, so. No, not that. That. All right. Well, one thing I can make, though, is a campfire. I looked up this recipe because I was like, oh, well, how am I going to make tempered glass? Well, that's a thing. And I should be able to make sticks, I believe. Yep, hey, look at that. Or not sticks, but uh, torches. Oh, hey, we have new mana craft. Awesome. Uh, what else can we do with peanuts? Uh, we can make a jar of peanut butter. Okay. We can cook 10 peanuts in... Well, not really cook, but 10 peanuts in a tempered glass jar equals dirt. All right, and that's pretty much any of these. Aye. Glass. How do we make glass? Just melting up sand. Okay. Sand. Uh, custom generating. Sandstone. And water and lava equal sand. Okay. With weight of 35, though. Well, that... Okay, if you look at the block itself, though, sandstone... It doesn't show up under custom generate. How about? Nope. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Wow. Why would I want to do this recipe when I can do that? Liquid interaction. It, it's not necessarily. You don't have to have the containment chalice to do these. But, uh. It does make it easier to automate and whatnot. So I'm going to need more bone meal in order to make that a, a thing, right? So I'm thinking instead of the bone block for now, we'll do get some grass. Used up all my peanuts on that. And, you know, I should probably get myself, like, a box to put things in, right? Quest complete chest. Okay, cool. All right. Let's get some of this stuff out of here, then. I made cow seeds and chicken seeds off camera as well. And I did get a couple of quests for those done. Uh, animal crops, here we go. And literally just a quest for everything there. Back to all rewards. Do we have rewards sitting somewhere? Because most of the quests I've seen so far have been no rewards. Uh, tinkers. What else we need here? We need a part chest. Okay. Resourceful bees. Right. Where, do I have any rewards? I don't think so. I'm not seeing any of the Oh, multiplayer. Okay, I'll just go ahead and get that out of here then. Campfire. Can make bricks. Yeah, eventually. Um, hmm. E DNA. Okay. Yeah, okay. That button doesn't do anything. What's our emergency items? A sapling and an apple. Okay. You have to wait five minutes to get those things. So, yeah, no. Not doing that, especially on camera. Right, that's about as much grass as I can get for right now, I think. Do you notice how I'm not getting any flowers at all? Dang it. Oh, wait, wait. I think I can know how to do this then. All right.
Turn four of you into white die. I can do that. There's our floral fertilizer. And we even got a blue flower first go. Awesome. All right, so let's put our brown and cyan away for now. And same with seeds. So I got tomato, corn, barley, strawberry, and radish seeds on top of the peanut now. Okay. Right, so I need a bowl. I'm going to need some more sticks. I believe it is like, no, not that. That, right? Nope. That. There we go. That's a little mortar from Batania. And then we need two more tool rods. Or tan or tool handle now. And then we just need the linking tool. Like so. Awesome. But now, unfortunately, I don't have my my bone block. And now I do. All right. So. Hey, we got clay. All right. Well, for the quest, I need apparently a clay block. And then I can uncraft it into that. There's our clay ball. But you're just three. Can I cook you on a campfire, though? I can. Yeah, that's probably the way to go then, right? Make a bucket. And... Then should a little pop off here? Uh, it's just taking a while to cook, isn't it? I guess you can set a custom cooking times on a campfire. But now we can actually start working towards the strainer. Wow, that thing is... There it goes. Alright, so what else... Wow, apparently... I didn't unlock that. Ceramic organic water bucket. Organic water. Is seeds plus water in a jar? Okay. Full soil. Lime blocks, full sand. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, right. So I need water then, right? Uh, also, apparently clay shears. Empty DNA, which is made from clay. DNA spawner. Okay, interesting. Something we'll get into later on. Uh, right. So here's a question. Water. All right, ceramic water bucket. Okay, well, I can cast water into it. How do we make liquid water? Ten leaves in a heated, aka low temperature jar, which a campfire will work on. That's, but it still has to be tempered glass. So I still need glass somehow. So I need sand. Right. And that's probably out of the reach for now. Entity melting drown or snowman. Okay. Boundary, melting. All right, so here's a question. Is there a way to make ice easily? Here's another question. Is there a crucible? Uh, no, not quite. What do I feel like leaves are somehow part of the equation to make water? Oh, because they are. Eight leaves in a no temperature jar dirt. Ten leaves in a low temp equals water. And okay. Well, yeah, bee breeding. That's it. Okay. Our boiler extractor for resin. So I need to... Wow, I need to type correctly is what I need. So temper glasses, it any forged glass pane. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think we're a ways away from tempered jars, though. Okay, so sand on a campfire equals... Okay. 
And Starlight Transmutation of Oak Logs into Sand. There we go. That's what I was looking for. At least it happens fairly quickly. There's a quest for sand, wasn't there? I completely missed it. Yeah, right here. Oh, hey, look. It tells you how. All right. At least I know how to use JEI. Uh, so I need seven glass panes. That's six. Okay. Seven. Uh, no, not you. You. And I'm just going to build this out a little bit around here. There we go. Now let's do like that. Now, how long are you going to take to cook? This is going to be one of those situations where I'm kicking myself for not making a second campfire. Eh, might be. So yeah, it is a little slow in the cooking time of the glass panes. Uh, looks like tempering them might be the same way. I'm kind of like acting myself into a bit of a corner here because I need cast iron. Okay, so brick turns into cast iron and gets... There we go. Bit odd, but okay. There's our tempered glass quest. Uh, I could make a regular water jar. This is just for storing liquids, though, pretty much. Which is useful for crafting later on, but for right now, regular glass jar really serves no purpose. And yeah, you do take a while, don't you? There we go. So I need more clay, right? I can put you down. And I'm going to be sitting here staring at my peanuts for a while, it looks like. That almost didn't sound right. Hey, look, we have a brick. Hey, and that's quest complete. Oh, we're kind of blitzing through here, aren't we? So, yeah, definitely need to automate the production of bone meal here soon. We have wooden hoppers, right? We should. Uh, we have a brick hopper from the brick hopper mod, but that's right. Tinkers doesn't have the wooden hoppers anymore. Wow, you really spat that thing out, didn't you? Don't you play off that edge again? I already lost one piece to the void. Uh, speaking of which, I should probably fill this in a little bit, right? All right, so that's three pieces of bone meal. I just throw wheat in here too. Oh yeah. But seeds, yeah, but seeds are horrible. So. But we're up to six pieces of bone meal already. So let me put. Half of those away. I don't think I need anything else for right now. Put that in there. Uh, crops wise, I mean. At least not until I get a, a tempered glass jar or some flavor. Uh, let's look up though. You. Here we go. So crafting table and two luminous crafting table. Okay. Diamond to emerald, iron to star metal. It's given. Magma block to obsidian, netherrack to nether brick, 
Nether wart to soul sand. Pumpkin to cake. Sandstone to endstone. Sea lantern to lapis. Lapis. Blowy block. Blowy. Uh, polished diorite to marble. Bone to clay. Oak to sand. That's it. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking peanuts is the best bet for right now. All right. It looks like I got the last of the cast iron I need. And yeah, I need six. So it's one, two, three, four. The gear. There's our cast iron tubes. Temper glass jar. All right. So there's the first one. Now, uh, no temp. Here we go. So tin of any flour into dirt. Okay. Sawdust into dirt. Dirt plus any seed into grass. All right. That's kind of cool. Ten apples. Ten of any crops into dirt. Okay. That's handy. That looks like 12 of any seed. 16 wool into bone blocks. Huh. Eight leaves into dirt. Yes, yeah, so that's probably what I'm going to go with right there is the leaves. At least for now. Um. Right. Here we go. Uh, yeah, that's going to take a second. Wow. Okay. So, look at you here. Uh, let's see. Any block times one. Trying obsidian is times three. Glowstone, one and a half or one and a quarter. Respawn anchor is times eight. Okay. But hey, we got ourselves some dirt. Now I need. Is that double compressed dirt? No, no, no. no that is. Uh, Compressed block of dirt times one, but I need two though, so I need 18 dirt for this quest here. I'm mean, guessing we use that to make lava with. All right. Uh, let's see, water now. Water was low temp with 10 leaves. So we take this guy over here. Got a nice red bottom to it. And this recipe. There we go. Um, oh, wow. Yeah, 128 seconds. That's going to take a little bit, but that'll get us a bucket of water anyway. Which means then we'll be able to actually get into water strainers eventually. And so crying obsidian will probably be, I mean, glowstone is better than nothing, right? 1.25 times, so it's a little bit faster. Uh, crying obsidian is the first block that we have that actually give us a decent increase in speed, though. At least for, for no temp operations. So... Rang Obsidian. Wow, really? All right, there's got to be other ways of getting that. It's just not showing up. I think six. Yeah, I need need more. Dang it. All right, well, our water got done, and we got one of these little FTB lib... Um, Water containers. Which, you know, awesome. Right click on a tank to empty the container. So that means I'm going to need a regular water jar now. I don't think you can place these in the world. Is that all for it was? Okay. 
And then I can grab one of these. We can get a box going like so. There's our first brick hopper. And yeah, I'm going to need more wood here soon. Looks like. Thank you. Because I'm going to need an actual water jar to get this put down. Dang. Oh, hey, I've got enough, though. That's just going to take a while to get. All right. Yeah, I can definitely tell I'm going to need a lot of jars. Oh, well. There is also the our auto processing block, which is kind of, oh, it's within reach, right? It just requires a lot of clay. Now, let's look at our clay again. Uh, were there any other methods that might be a little bit nicer? Just the water strainer. Okay. Now. So water strainer is uh, relatively within reach. I just need two more brick. And I wonder if we have phantoms spawning in this map or not. Be one of those good to know things. Also, let's just go ahead and eat this apple. Give. All right, so I can go here into a button and then we can take the seven. There's our water jar. Uh, you know, we can put it right there for now. Hey, there we go. And got a bucket of water. All right, cool. So then we have that quest done now. And that means that we can actually get the water strainer done here soon, which, okay, sticks from bamboo, I think, four string. Uh, I think we can make that pretty easily here. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. Uh, between episodes, I'm probably going to go ahead and get that water strainer up and running. So that way we can actually start getting supplies in. I'm also going to have to do some tree farming from the looks of things. And here, tell you what, you just do that. And we'll, I guess we can go ahead and make this thing up right now. Ring mesh. Rivalist trainer, 120 uses. Okay, not bad. 25% chance of sand, clay, 20% chance of dirt, 15% chance each of stick or gravel. All right. I mean, we can work with that. Uh, we've got a good amount of wheat seeds showing up here, too. Now, the thing I don't like is it's not showing all of the recipes we can do. It's not auto filtering. It's showing literally every temperature with, uh, or every recipe with a low temperature. There we go. Uh, yeah, a bucket of each into there to make that. Eh, I guess it's the thing. And there's water. That's it. Okay. So 16 wool into bone blocks is not bad. Water and sand into clay is not horrible either. I wonder if we have infinite water. <laughs> oh, well, we'll figure it out. But thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this first episode, and until the next one, sign signing out. Have fun.